So, Mike, thanks for coming in. Um, you know, this, this Bobby that I mentioned, uh, he's already missed three days of school. On probation, you know, that can't happen. Mm -hmm. Do you know what's going on with him? I don't. I don't know exactly what's going on. I know um, they have some uh, gang wars going on in the school, but that's the most that I know. I know that he's a good kid. I know that... Um, he got in trouble at some point for uh, shoplifting. Yeah, well, yeah, that's originally why he got sent up, yeah. so. I think he's been pretty clean since then. Um, uh, right up until high school, and since he started high school, he's been ditching, and now it's been three days straight, and it, it can't happen. You know, I'm going to have to send him back to juvenile hall. Oh, man. So I just wanted to give you a heads up and, and see if you knew anything about him, what's going on, you know. Uh, I think that should be the last resort, if that's possible, you know. Um, if we could find some type of alternative, you know, to sending them back to juvenile. Such as what? How about we have a sit down? How about we get together with him and, and find out exactly what's going on? Just take a moment with to him. talk. Yeah, just to talk and find out what he has to say. Because I'm, I'm sure there has to be a reason. Uh, he's going he's gonna to plead his case and tell me some sob story or something. You know, I've heard it before. You know, the law is the law. I can only do so much. But I, I have a feeling about this kid. I have a feeling that um, there's more to it. You know, I don't think that um, he's one of those. <laughs> you know, I don't think he should get lost in the system. I think we just should give him a chance. You know, there's a lot of good kids that get lost in the system every day. You know, I, why is this one different? Yeah. You know, I just, I just know what I see, or what we're not seeing, which is him in school. Mm -hmm. You know, and uh, if he's hanging out with some gang, or what, what is it that's, that's keeping him out? Do you know this kid? I mean, I've spoken to him once or twice. Uh, he's friends with my nephew, but I, I think that there may be a little more going on under the surface. I think, really? Yeah, I think before we prejudge him, um, let's give him a chance. You know, if we can just get together, sit down and talk. You know, I, I, can't, I can't favor one kid over another. I gotta treat them all fairly. I've got too many cases, you know, and, and, I, and we've been friends for a long time, but you know, I, I, can't, I can't do any favors. I mean, I think what happens is a lot of times kids get lost in the system. Mm -hmm. You know, every and day, every day. And it's unfortunate. And sometimes there's that one that just sticks out like there's something about this kid. You know, <laughs> it, let's let's find out what's going on. You know, and I think this is one of those situations. You got a big heart. You too. Well, somewhere in there, I guess. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so can we do that? Can we have a sit down? Sure. Talk? Sure. You know, I can't promise you anything. OK, but I'm willing to try if you think it'll help. All I'm asking is to sit down and talk. You got it. Okay. All right. You name the date, the time. I'll be there. All right. I'll find out. Okay. Thank you. All right. Good seeing you. Right. Same here. Take care. Okay.